On Friday night, the Army women's soccer team hosted Seton Hall as part of the 2011 Black Knight Classic. After a scoreless opening frame, the Black Knights got on the board just over two minutes into the second half. Gordon lets it go between her legs and will swing it to the far side and the freshman Wilson from Santa Maria, California. Into on just inside the 18. She spins, she fires. That will go in and Kim on buries her first goal of the season. I looked, didn't really see anyone, took like a touch and then just smacked it with my left foot far corner and uh, it was just like a really good play and you know, getting the ball into my feet in the box is what I want, you know, because then I can make something happen and it it was just a perfect ball and just it was right there. It was great. <laughs> but Seton Hall would have a great chance of their own in the 52nd minute. After a cross went through the box, Melissa McClaw stopped the shot on the doorstep to keep Army's lead intact. Goalie Monica Lee would make four saves in the second half to secure the win for the Black Knights. Even with the visitors firing shots in bunches late in the match, Lee kept her cool. Honestly, that's that's like my favorite part of the game. Um, stress is high, but that's I mean when that's your opportunity to step up and make things happen. After the match, head coach Stephanie Golan praised her team's defense. We love it, and one of the things that we like most about it is that you know we had different players who played tonight. We had different players who played in the back. We had different players who played in the midfield, and we still didn't miss a beat. You know, we were still able to to really lock things down. We got quality minutes out of a lot of players. Mo was uh, was excellent. She had one bobble at one point that Mel cleared off the off the line, but that's what this is. This is a team effort, and we're we're very happy. The Black Knights return to the field on Sunday when they take on Stetson in the finale of this weekend's tournament. Reporting from Clinton Field, Rick Johnston, ITT Night Vision.